Again, with the COVID surge in Southern California, the virus is spreading faster than ever. And tonight, a warning that our hospitals could be overwhelmed in just a few weeks. Also tonight, it is the end for dining at LA County restaurants as we start this Thanksgiving holiday. We do have team coverage for you tonight, beginning with KCAL 9's Stacy Butler live tonight in Long Beach. Stacy. Susie and Jeff, there's no question that doctors expected a surge this winter, but these explosive numbers before Thanksgiving has many worried. Tonight, the holiday COVID surge that local ER doctors have long feared is here. Now, unfortunately, we're seeing it before Thanksgiving even hits. So I was hoping that we would wait until Thanksgiving and then see the exponential spike up, but this has basically supercharged it. And now Thanksgiving is just going to, you know, kick it into outer space. In LA County, the number of new infections has doubled in the past two weeks. The virus is spreading faster than ever. About one in every 145 Los Angeles County residents are currently infectious. They may not know they're infected. They may uh, know they're infected and not be isolating, but they're out there and they're exposing other people to the virus. Because of it, hospitalizations are up 70% the past two weeks. Hospitals can add beds, but warn their doctors and nurses and techs will burn out and stress out if numbers keep climbing and soon. There will likely be shortages in the number of hospital beds and especially in an ICU beds or intensive care unit beds over the next two to four weeks. In some places, it's already happening. We have a full ICU of people with COVID on ventilators who are fighting for their lives. So this is real. This is not imaginary. And all of those are preventable. Tonight, as people finish shopping for Thanksgiving, the question, do they believe the danger is real? Because a lot of people say COVID's real, then a lot of people say it's not, so I don't know what to believe, but just to stay safe, I think I'd rather just stay home and not with like a lot of people. We've already changed our plans, not only for Thanksgiving, but as well as for Christmas. We've made changes. And I think it's not until everybody's doing their part and really doing what we're supposed to be doing, then we're going to have a handle on this. And doctors really want to send that message that it's not too late. We're approaching Thanksgiving. Uh, definitely just try to be as careful as you can. That's the very latest from Long Beach. Back to you guys in the studio.